We've had, on average, in the state, uh, 15 months it's taken to get to a, a negotiated contract. We don't have 15 months to balance a budget. And uh, on top of that, probably more importantly, is uh, even if the state can reach that, we, we have a state budget that's going to have an impact on every local government in the state of Wisconsin, every school board, every city council, every county board, uh, every local government in turn. And, for us to have uh, hundreds of, of different contracts that potentially may or may not be uh, negotiated successfully, to me, is just unacceptable. We want to make sure that the public and that the community and that Mr. Walker knows that you have to follow due process to get a bill through. And that means the public has a right to comment on it. This, this is a frequently misstated fact in this capital. Uh, civil service protections, worker rights are protected by the civil service system in the state of Wisconsin. It's the strongest civil service system in the country. Uh, it was in place long before collective bargaining. It will still be in place uh, after our budget uh, repair bill passes. And so things like being uh, hired based on merit, having just cause uh, for discipline and discharge, all those things are in place because of the civil service system, not because of collective bargaining. They're codified in collective bargaining, but they will not change just as they're in place for non-unionized employees right now. So workers will still be protected. Uh, the main change for a worker after this bill passes is that everybody, me, they, uh, management and labor alike, will all be paying uh, slightly more, a modest amount for pension and health care contributions, and uh, all state workers will no longer uh, automatically have to be in a union, and they'll get to keep that money because we're not going to automatically deduct that from their payroll. That's five to six hundred dollars or more depending on the union they were in. That's money they can use to offset the higher payments for health care uh, and for a, a pension contribution. This is a bill that is going to hurt a whole lot of people and it's going to make the state a lot weaker. There's other things he can look at. This is a bill that was hastily thought out and it needs to have public hearings. There needs to be talk. Well, for us, we've got a budget that comes up next Tuesday. These are issues I talked about during the campaign. I talked about right after the election. I talked about when the contracts were up in December. I talked about the inauguration. I talked about it two weeks ago at the State of the State. So nobody should be surprised about what we're doing. We've talked about it for the last two years. Uh, anyone who's surprised about this has been in a coma uh, because uh, this has been pretty apparent out there. Uh, the key difference is, uh, and maybe they're shocked in Madison, but. I'm fulfilling yet again things I said I would do on the campaign trail. Kill, love, kill. Kill.